The Castellau bar. A couple have had a row and the man has assaulted the woman. The man's still there. It's a case of domestic violence. He's very drunk. There are no witnesses to the assault. Let's see if she wants to make a statement. Did anyone see the incident? Nobody wants to talk about it. Hello, this is the police. I'm calling from the victim support unit. Can you spare a moment to talk about what happened to your wife and the statement she made? Everything's fine, I don't know what you mean. Right, but your wife made a statement against you. You know that, don't you? Yes. She said that you threatened her and you hit her. It's not true, everything's fine. M maybe we had a bit of a tiff, but nothing out of the ordinary. It happens in every family, right? I didn't hit her, we keep family disputes to ourselves, we don't wash our dirty linen in public. She must have had a bad day and just wanted to let off steam. Frankly, I've got no idea what this is all about. All these cases irritate and surprise me. The victims make a statement setting out the events in great detail. And then, when you try to talk to them, the men who assaulted these women, they try to just pass it off or even complain that their wives or girlfriends are just trying to get back at them. I'm not a wife beater, a potential killer, or anything like that. But I've treated my wife badly. When I think of it now, I was really acting crazy. I did wrong and I'm terribly sorry about it now. But the harm is done. There's no getting away from it. What do you do when you have a problem? I try to talk about it, but if I feel ignored, I tend to lose my temper. If a man like this feels mistreated, then basically it's as if he feels he's a victim. It triggers a defensive mechanism, and then their usual defensive response is to attack whenever they feel threatened. If they feel that things in the family are not going well, they get violent and lash out. It's as if wife beaters feel they have a mission to run their families according to their own very rigid principles, which are based on inequality and the abuse of power. I believe I'm a home-loving, hard-working man who takes care of his wife. They've been very hard on me. I'm not a wife-beater and I haven't mistreated anyone. I'm not bitter towards her. I know I'm guilty of letting her down. I suppose they had to punish me. Not that it will do me any good. I shouldn't be in prison, you know what I mean? It's very tough. I never thought I would ever end up in a place like this. Never. Thanks to the sessions we've had with you, I'm beginning to see where I went wrong. That's what we're here for, and it's what the program is all about. I'm glad you've thought about what you did. It means the first few sessions have been of some help. When it comes to human behaviour, there's always some risk. No matter what we do, former wife beaters will often end up running into their spouses. They want to keep in touch with their victims, and we can't guarantee that they won't repeat their crimes.